Hey guys, welcome to the start of a brand new week on WGT, which means we are playing the nine hole single play event this week at Kyo Island. Let's see if we can earn some credits. Not that we really need many credits right now, we have got over 2,000. Uh, but you know, it's always nice to have more. Makes it's earn them quicker, I suppose. Alright. Clicked a bit too soon, that's probably going to put us in trouble. Our opening t shirt, that's a shame. Can you get back into the fairway for me? Into the fairway? Alright, we got away with that one, I think. Just about. Alright, we're going into the wind. So it. Oh. Cure. Alright, well, we shouldn't run out of green if I hit it full power. I'm going to do that. Put some backspin on that and hopefully get it reasonably close to the flag. Uh, go there. And I pushed it. Of course I did. At least going to be up on the green. Alright, we've got to look at it. It might be uphill. Uh, so, th there's that. It is uphill. Seems to be a bit more aggressive with it, but that's a horrible character we're looking at again. I am just going to whack this towards the hole and hopefully it somehow goes in. Tournament greens. Okay. Uh, not good. But, um, it was close. Again, really not sure here. Just going to hit it there. Oh, there we go. Nice and straight. Okay, onto the par five. Uh, same for this part of the fairway over here. Hopefully, throw it right. Yes, hitting the sweet spot means we should be safely into the fairway. There we go. Got to go for the green again. Although we are going downwind, so mm, take a look at that. Probably not a good idea. Still, just going to aim over to the left here. And uh two one six, resin's about right. Use the wind. Click a bit late. Wind should take care of that still, I hope. Oh, is that perfect into the rough? Nothing it just about missed. Okay, so sorry. Someone's flying around me then. <laughs> right. Wind's gonna take it to the left, green's gonna take it to the right. Aim it there. Shut the backspin on and go about 45. Push it a bit. Oh. It's going to be inside a couple of yards still, though, at least. You going to come around for us? No, of course you're not. You're going to stay right above the hole. Great. So that's not a gimme either. I'm going to aim it here. I'm going to hit it just beyond 1.5 and hopefully it doesn't just dive below the hole. Well, there we go. It's one of those days again, by the looks of it. Oh well, save the good stuff for the showdowns, right? Okay. Whack. Probably gonna run out of fairway now. Shouldn't do. Really, really shouldn't do. There we go, we're fine. Just inside 95 yards. Uh, wind's going to make it a bit harder though to judge. We're going straight into that. Well, straight down it, sorry. Uh, of course, another camera to chat with again. Which is nice. Going to aim out here. Chuck all that on. 86. 7, 88. 88. Okay. It's going to be close again. That'll do nicely. So we can finally make a birdie, shall we? What have we got here? It's going to try and turn a bit on us. So aim at the left half and uh, give it enough. It shouldn't break too much. There we go. That's a birdie. We are one under par. Although we could have probably been two under by now. Really should have been two under by now. Uh, I'm just going to hit this t-shirt out to the 
right a bit, but sweet spot means uh, it should come around nicely to the left-hand side, I hope. Looks like we did it. Can't get it towards that flag, so I'm just going to try and stick it on the green and uh, get down two putts, I guess. That second camera really isn't helping. I aim out here. Three iron into the wind a bit. Should get us back there, shouldn't it? Probably going to go more towards the flag. I don't know. Looks like we're on the green. Or the fringe. Okay, that, that can work. Uh, in that case, I can perhaps flop this. I don't know. It's probably not the best idea from here. Maybe a pitch will work better. I'll try and pitch it across the length of the green. Alright, so 10 yards is roughly where we get to the slope. 8.5. Give it the 10, I guess. Go about there. Hope this works out. I'm pretty sure there's a slope there. I'm pretty sure there's a slope there. Uh, so we're having that shot straight back. What a surprise. Oop. Let's go turn a bit and then let's go try and turn back again. That's nice. That's, uh, that's nice. About there. See what that does for us. Oh, okay. Yeah, you want it at like a normal green. If I'd hit that hard, it would have probably gone about six feet past. Oops. Right. So this one to save our bogey. Cool. All right. At level par after immediately. Well, straight after making a birdie. Uh, we are going downwind here, so bravely hit a free iron. About about there. No spin. And uh hopefully it finds some part of the green. Be nice. Although equally nice if it you know, yeah, just went just off the green. Alright. Not a good decision by me there. Uh, flopping it onto a down slope. Definitely not ideal. 9.5, 11.5. Try about there. I mean, I couldn't hit that any softer because it would just get stuck in uh, that glue stuff we call the fringe or the fairway again. So it's probably about as good as I could do there. Hey, I'm sure I'm going to hold this one because, you know, I've got us to level past somehow, haven't I? And I can't imagine we'll be making birdies later on. So... That, I guess. Yeah, see? Still a little parvin. Alright, after that short delay we are back. Uh, right inside the fairway. Ride the wind. Back in. So that should work out just fine. Quite a long way from the green, mind. Wow. 200 yards still. Okay, got a right to left wind. Uh, Hitting at least the three iron here, aren't we? So three iron or three wood, really. Let's try to think. Chuck a little bit of that and try and slow it down when it lands. It's got a K182 though. Oh, I think I've just got to hit this, haven't I? Try and stop it as quick as I can. Come on, please work. It's a bit late, but hopefully that should work on the wind. And that did not really roll out much, did it? 
Alright, birdie putt, but a long one. Let's see if we can perhaps hold that. Downhill quite a bit. But it says we're going uphill. Interesting. Uh, let's just hit it slightly more than 30. Get ourselves inside 10 feet and go from there again, I guess. You can turn back in, you can turn back in. <laughs> I mean, it's teetering on the edge. I think I could get that 10 seconds, haven't I? No, I'm just kidding, I'm not going to do that. Doesn't work like that in the game, does it? Oh, we should have held that. Oh well, par 5, opportunity to make a birdie now, again. Uh, I'm going to aim out to the left here, nice and safe. And, uh, yeah, sweet spot. Once you bring that back in, it would be nice if we were inside 240 yards for a change. But we're not going to be. Although, downwind, maybe I'll give us a whack at the green. What have we got to land on? Hmm. Upslope there, that's not ideal. But, uh... If I whack into the upslope right in front of the green, that might work. So, uh... Tiniest bit of that. We don't want to go too long here, do we? Not quite full power. And click a bit too soon as well, that should do it. Yeah, that's the... Fl Is that in the bunker? Rough. I was going to say. Alright, coming out of rough, but also going downwind. I'm going to get as close to full power and try and stop it as quick as I can. So, about there. To fly the green, isn't it? <laughs> Alright. At least we can putt from there, although it's not the nice screen to be putting on from any distance. Uh, I don't think it's going to turn back too much. I'm just going to aim out here, hit it the 15, and hope it drops in. And there's a the turn back in. Oh boy. If I hadn't pulled that, that was probably in. What a surprise. One of my many catchphrases. Alright, still level parvin. Uh that's actually quite a nice flag for us today. Uh gonna regret this decision I'm sure. But I'm just gonna try and get a run down there. Hit this full power. Full backspin. Run down to the flag. Please. And looks like it's going to do it. It's going to get us inside 10 feet. I just don't know how much inside 10 feet. You're going to turn for me. You're going to turn for me. Turn back towards the hole. Turn, turn, turn. Okay, now stop. Stop right there. Stop right there. Okay. That's not a bad place to be, I think. Uh, not much of a break there, so it would really be my fault if uh I suppose my cat's in the room again. <laughs> it would be bad if I didn't hold this putt, wouldn't it? I'm gonna aim at this left edge. And uh yeah, hit it six pretty much. There we go. Back to one under par. Let's see if we can build on that in our final hole if we can. And not do the opposite and throw that shot straight back again. Let's not do that. Just get out here to the right, hit the sweet spot again, good. Uh, which means we should be in the middle of the fairway, hopefully. And again, a long way back. Uh, do I just hit the four iron here, try and get it up there? What's the best place to miss? Probably not short, but... Um, hmm. Aim it out here. Pull it a bit. Full power. So push it a bit. There we go. And the wind still caught it pretty heavily. Okay, that's probably not the worst place to leave it. I really don't know. I flop this one in. Uh, 
Yeah. I'm going to flop it. The difference between being under par and level par this shot. So let's see. 9.5, 11.5. Uh, 13.5. Hmm. We're going to regret this choice, but here goes. Huh. There we go. After all that, two under par. Let's see what that puts on the leaderboard. You know, I always say, let's see what that puts on the leaderboard, but really what I do is I come here, check that I'm five shots behind. And then just see what top 20 is, really. So 30 was top 20. You could play the, uh, not the realistic game, but the, where we should have been. We could figure out where we should have been. I would have probably been four under par without any bogeys, and if I hold a few more putts, so probably just outside top 20, probably about 50, if something like that. Anyway, <clears throat> thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, I will see you later.